Okay, so recently I got this box containing a bottle of San Miguel and a San Miguel glass, which I think looks really, really nice. Um, there's also a package as well, which should contain 53mm solid bowding balls from AliExpress. So, let's take a look at this first. So, on the box it says, exploring the world since 1890. And there it says a 330ml bottle of San Miguel and a branded San Miguel chalice glass. Just see if there's anything on the bottom. Nope. And uh, yeah, I'm not going to read all of that out, so just pause the video if you want to read it. I'm just seeing if there's anything interesting to point out. Um, mm, I, don't, I don't think so. It's 5%. So, let's open this. So I did open the box before, about half an hour ago, just so I can take the bottle out and put it into the freezer for half an hour. Because I do like to drink my beer really, really cold. So, yeah. So I don't think this was that much. I think it was something like maybe £3 something. Let's see. Bottle. It's uh, it's quite small. Um, there is the glass, and I just think that is a really nice looking glass. I already have a very similar looking uh, San Miguel glass, which is this one. So I'll just zoom in so you can see the comparison between the two. And there's the uh, the backs of them. So, and yeah, nothing on the back. Alright, so let's crack it open. Got a really ancient um, bottle opener there, a Vimto one. Let's pour it into my new glass. Oops. So yeah, here's a really small bottle, that's why it's not filled the glass up. It's only filled about halfway. So let's take a nice close up look at this glass actually. So it's got writing there as well. Um, What's it saying? I uh, spe E Special Premium um, International Visa. I don't know what that means. And there's, there's more writing as well. 189. All right. So uh, yeah, let's uh, let's see what the aroma is like. Really, really nice. Um, kind of. Kind of reminds me of honey ale a bit. Let's see what it tastes like. It's really nice. Um, it's so difficult to describe though. It doesn't really taste like a honey ale, I don't think. I guess maybe a golden ale. It's, um, it's got a fairly strong flavour. It's kind of got a bit of a bite to it. And uh, that's all I can say, really. It's it's just um, it's just really difficult to describe the uh, the flavour. But yeah, let's open up this package from AliExpress. And this feels pretty heavy. down a bit there. Yeah, quite a dirty looking bag. Oh, 
And here it is. It's quite a nice looking case. Yeah, it does look quite cheaply made, but you know, you're not really when you buy this, you're not really paying for the case. You're paying for the uh, the bowling balls that are inside. I mean, yeah, pretty bad quality. I think the actual case, I think it's just cardboard or something with like material over it. So let's open this up. Wow, that looks pretty impressive. These are uh, these bowling balls are really really big. So I think I think they are fifty millimeters. Just absolutely massive, and I think they are solid. That's what they were advertised as. Let's compare the size of them to the other bowling balls that I have, which are smaller. Hopefully they won't roll off the table. Looks like they're gonna. So these are my other ones, and the case is the same kind of case as this one. It's a bit smaller and it's a different colour. Um, these ones, the really nice quality. Um, it's got like bells in, in them. So yeah, you can see these ones are a lot bigger. see a pretty decent reflection in them as well so uh, yeah let's see what these are like they just feel so heavy but yeah even though they are really big and heavy they are quite easy to use let's see now put that there. Put that there. so it looks like I now have balls of steel cool so, um, that's pretty much it. Um, feels like this is going to be quite a short video. Um, but yeah, you know, what more can I say? San Miguel, really nice looking glass. Beer tastes nice, but it's kind of difficult to describe the flavour. And two giant 53mm um, solid bowling balls. Cheers.